Have you ever wondered why some people can lift incredible weights, yet they don't necessarily look like bodybuilders? It's a question that perplexes many, and the answer is rooted in the fascinating strength paradox. You see, strength and size are not one and the same. A bulky physique may imply power, but strength is about much more than just muscle mass. It's about the efficiency of your nervous system, the effectiveness of your muscle fibers, and the power of your will. And then, there's the topic of fueling for strength training. It's not just about what you eat, but when you eat and how you eat. And it's not just about feeding your muscles, it's also about fueling your nervous system. Because, at the end of the day, your muscles are only as strong as the signals they receive. So, if size doesn't equal strength, what does? The answer, my friends, lies in the fuel. Now that we understand strength isn't only about size, let's dive into what fuels our strength. Nutrition. Imagine your body as a high-performance vehicle. Just as that vehicle requires the right type of fuel to function optimally, your body needs the right nutrients to perform at its peak. These nutrients, known as macronutrients, are the building blocks of our body's strength and vitality. Proteins, carbohydrates, and fats each play a unique role in your strength training journey. Let's start with proteins. Picture proteins as the building blocks of your muscles. After a rigorous workout, your muscles are like a house that's been torn down. Proteins help to rebuild and repair that house, making it stronger than before. They are the key to muscle recovery and growth. Moving on to carbohydrates. If proteins are the builders, carbohydrates are the power generators. They provide the energy that fuels your workouts. When you're lifting weights or doing high-intensity exercises, it's the carbohydrates that keep you going. Then we have fats. Often misunderstood, fats are essential for hormone regulation, including those hormones that directly influence muscle growth and strength. So, don't shy away from healthy fats, but knowing what to eat is only half the battle. Understanding when to eat is equally important. The timing of your meals can significantly impact your training. A well-balanced meal before your workout can provide the energy you need to push through. And don't forget about post-workout nutrition. Refueling your body after a strenuous session is crucial. It helps replenish energy stores and aids in muscle recovery. Think of it as giving your body the tools it needs to repair the damage caused during the workout. In essence, what you eat and when you eat it plays a pivotal role in your strength training journey. It's like a finely tuned symphony. Every element must work in harmony to produce the best results. Remember, the right fuel at the right time can be the difference between a good workout and a great one. We've learned about the paradox of strength and the fuel that drives it. Now it's time to put that knowledge into action. The world of strength training is as varied as the individuals who dedicate themselves to it. Each one of us is unique, and so too should be our approach to fueling our bodies. Consider the information we've shared not as a rigid blueprint, but as a compass, guiding you towards a more effective, personalized strength training regimen. Experimentation is key. Play around with your nutrition. See how different foods, meal timings, and portions affect your performance. It might take time to find what works best for you, but the rewards are well worth it. After all, what we put into our bodies directly impacts what we can get out of them. As we wrap up, consider this. If you could tweak your nutrition to gain just 5% more strength, what would that look like in your training? 